when you're doing your fuchs up, you want these fingers to be pointing there. So you create a path that goes away from you. So you say, I can't strike you now. So let's so say you try to do the time without blocking your arm. Some people do it with the hand this way. You can strike me. Right? Keep the palm up just for the sake of the street. Keep the palm up. You can touch me. Some people do the foot this way. The foot is supposed to look like a fox's paw because the character for folk is a hound and a man. Folk. Your folk, your finger should be pointing down so that you can't touch me. Palms up. Right? If I do this, even if my elbow's in the center, you can touch me. And if I do this, you can touch me. So it should look like a fox's paw because the character for folk is a hound and a man combined. The man's controlling the hound. So, say if we were doing Chi Sao, and I, let's see, let me do this side. And if I do a folk like this, and you strike at me, I have to jut to do something. I have to do a secondary move. But if I'm here, you strike, I don't have to do anything. Because I'm creating a path, let's see, a path away from me, as opposed to having a hand this way, here. And folk means to control. You're not controlling anything here. Feel the control? So when you see dogs play, fight, they do this with each other, like this, that's what you're doing, okay? So one other thing, the bong sound. Can I borrow you? The bong is like the inverse of the, uh, the tongue. So when you turn it, the finger should point away, not like this, lazily. So, say you're doing a quan, a quan sound, a quan, a quan, okay? The finger's like this. And you were to throw, well, forget it. I don't have to throw. See, there's a round kick coming. Point your fingers this way. You're going to break your fingers. Plus, if I do my chi sao, and you do that bone sao like that, I mean, I get all kinds of stuff. You know? Okay? <laughs> Another thing. So, also, the folk should be like this. Strong folk, so I can't come in. See? Some people do a floppy and do this. So if you do that, floppy folk, I can strike you. If you do it with folk style, no, stay in your occupy that line. See? You can direct me. Okay? And you don't want to drive the bus. I'm issuing my energy towards you the whole time. So don't do this. If I go this way, carry me, carry me. Continue my force, I'm going that way. So I'm doing circles, so take me that way. Right? See? So if I'm going. Do it whenever you're ready. See? You got it. So my energy should always be issuing, issued towards the, my opponent's center of mass. Okay? Be able to do two different things. So the left side of your brain controls the right side of your body and vice versa. So when you're doing Sulong Tao, this hand shouldn't be sitting here like this. The opposite hand. It should be at least two fingers from your body. So I'm actually focused on this hand. I'm not just letting it lazily stay there. You see some people just do this always here. So that's your first uh, training to learn to use both sides independently of each other. Okay?